scopes in OWASP SAM and how are they managed in SAMI. A scope is basically the organization for which you want to do an assessment. This can be a business unit, this can be a product team, this can be a product group, or this can be individual teams. Uh, you can be as granular as you want to. If you go to the OWASPSAM.org website, you will find a lot of guidance on how to best establish scope. But in general, it's up to you and it depends on uh, whom do you want to have a scoring for and which, uh, which parts of the organization do you want to compare with each other. How is this implemented in SAMI? Well, you go to Manage and you go to Scopes. And there, initially, you will have just one standard uh, scope, which is your uh, organization. But you can add more scopes to this uh, by clicking Create a new scope. Now, here it asks you if it has a parent scope. That is because scopes could be hierarchical. Uh, it could be that uh, you have a higher level scope and then uh, subscopes being the, the business unit and uh, product teams, for example. It's also going to ask you which, uh, which models you would like to use in this scope and uh, which teams will be working on that scope. Here, for example, we have a business unit one which has four product groups. This means we can do assessments for an individual product group or we can do assessments for the overall business unit. Um, in some cases, you may want to do an assessment overall and uh, different assessment in the subgroups. In some cases, the um, scoring of the uh, mother group would be aggregated. You can find this in the overview scores. So here at the bottom, you have a, a SAM score for those that have at least partially filled out their SAM assessments. Uh, and these are validated scores. Uh, above that, in the business units, we have uh, the, the blue one, which is the actual assessment at that level, or the uh, red one, which is the aggregated score of all the daughters that have a assessment at this point.